Kuhn Backyard Rendering Tutorial. The backyard is divided into indoor and outdoor spaces. Interior space. Outdoor space. After adjusting the angle, the first step is to find a suitable ambient light template. If you want to render more realistically, be sure to choose to create a custom light template. So we create a custom template and select Realistic Outdoor. Then enter the edit page of this template. Do not adjust the brightness of the sun and then modify it according to the rendering effect. First adjust the azimuth and height of the sun to get the desired shadow position and length. After adjusting the sunlight, add a light source to the interior and add a rectangular or circular light source according to the position of the conventional lighting equipment. At this point, we don't understand how the brightness values of these light sources affect the final effect, so let's put them in the right position without adjusting the values. Then exit the custom light source interface and select a suitable environment map template. Because this scheme is the design of the backyard, and there are a lot of trees in the backyard. So I chose textures that echo that do not adjust the parameters of the texture, just try to render with the lowest resolution to see the lighting effect. It can be seen that the overall environment is a little darker now, so we increase the brightness of the environment and the brightness of the indoor lights. Now let's render again to see the effect. This time it can be seen that the indoor lighting is overexposed, so the indoor lighting parameters need to be modified. Now we rescale and render again. It can be seen that the indoor brightness here is still a little low, especially the rear is too dark, so it needs to continue to adjust. It can be seen that the light is relatively coordinated now, so we render the high resolution image. So now we have a high resolution rendering. After rendering, we also need to use the image beautification function. Note that the lighting effects of the renderings obtained from different camera cuts may be different. Therefore, each rendering needs to be debugged. Here is the first one as an example. Therefore, each rendering needs to be debugged. Here is the first one as an example. So finally, let's enjoy the modified picture. Thank you.